I did not know this before I moved, but networking is an important aspect of career and personal development. It is never too early to start building your network. I did not know that when I was younger. As a young adult, you have to take advantage of being able to build a wide network of diverse contacts. And here are some tips to help you do just that. And I will say before I begin, Anna Delvey had the network of networks and look how she's doing even after jail. Come on. First of all, attend events. Attending events like career fairs, networking events, and professional conferences can be a great way to meet new people and build your network. Look for events that are related to fields you're interested in and be sure to bring business cards or other materials that make it easy for others to connect with you or connect with them afterwards. Take out the lead. Make sure you're writing down on your phone a list of the people you met so that you can follow up afterwards really easily. Use social media. Social media platforms like LinkedIn and Twitter can be a great tool for networking. Connect with professionals in your field Join groups related to your interests and participate in online discussions to showcase your expertise and build relationships with others. I know I started a podcast and that was a great way for me to meet so many other people in PR and marketing. And that's how I landed one of my jobs. Volunteer. Volunteering for a cause you're passionate about can be a great way to meet people and build your network. Not only will you be doing something good for others, but you'll be meeting people who share your interests and values. Aren't those the kind of people you want to know? People who care about the same things you care about? Get involved in clubs or organizations. Joining clubs or organizations related to your interests can help you meet new people and expand your network. Whether you join a sports club or a hobby group or a professional association, getting involved can be a great way to meet new people and build meaningful relationships. Now, this one is huge, and this is where I am the worst at. Follow up after meeting someone new. Be sure to follow up with them and maintain that connection. Whether it's an email or phone call or social media message, following up is an important step in building and maintaining a relationship. I know I wish I was so much better at this. There are business mentors I've had that I just haven't reached out to and then suddenly it's like oh it's been two years but you still want to reach out to them because you're like oh I care about you and I hope you're doing well but it's been so long be generous one of the best ways to build your network is to be generous with your time expertise and resources we don't gatekeep here offer your help to others when you can and be sure to reciprocate when someone offers help to you most of all be yourself when networking People are more likely to connect with you when they see you as a real person with genuine interests and passions, so don't be afraid to be yourself. You can tell when somebody is being shady, when it seems like they're just, you know, being nasty, you don't want to be around them. Don't be afraid to be yourself and let your personality shine through. In conclusion, networking is an important aspect of personal and career growth, and it's never too early to start building your network. By attending events, using social media, and volunteering, getting involved in clubs or organizations, and following up to maintain that relationship, you can build a diverse and valuable network of contacts that will serve you well throughout your life, and that hopefully you can also serve well throughout your life. I hope you have a great day, and that's helpful.